This week on The Choice. You know, I have to tell you something. You know, hunting, as much as we've hunted my whole life, is it takes a definite step backwards when you know that your child is going to start hunting with you. I think I was way more nervous than he was. Hunting is not about the trophy. It's about the challenges that we face as hunters, and it is our choice how we pursue our prey. Hunting doesn't end when you spot your game. That's when the challenge begins. Closing the distance, becoming part of your surroundings, playing the wind, being patient, and waiting for that moment of truth. From the maximum highs to the ultimate lows, there is no way of predicting how things will turn out. For us, it's about the adventure. The journey. The moments that we share as a family. This, this is, is why, why we hunt. hunt. This, this is, is our choice. Perfect. That's Good where we want to be, one inch high. Good shooting, That's buddy. awesome. What? Yeah, yeah I, I don't okay, know. headphones. I like these. Why? Yeah. Okay. Hey, welcome oh, this week's The Choice. It's a brand new season, The Choice. Yes, can you believe it? Another year with The Choice. That's right. And like usual, we're going to have Lucky Logo. RJ, you know what this week's Lucky Logo is? Maristep. A Maristep, the ultimate in ground blinds and tree stands. So you need to watch for the Maristep logo, and then the show will tell them what to do. But this week, we're going to head to Northern California. I can't hear you. With Aero 5 Outfitters, Jeez. Jim and Tina Marie. Huh? That's one of our favorite places, isn't it? We're gonna go blacktail hunting up in Northern California. Last week on the Archer's Choice Show, Ralph went ahead and got his with his Hoyt. And you and I Hoyt, are out, baby. we're gonna leave Daddy home this week alone, okay? Yeah. You and I will go out there and have fun. What do you think, okay? Yeah. All right, you were just a hair high, so we just need to adjust the scope and we'll try again, okay? Okay. What? Are you are you on her side? What? I see all this. I got it, what? I see. Roxanne! Oh my God, you blew my ear. These are on. These are on, <laughs> and it and it actually made it, it like it blocked the noise. That was awesome. I don't have to listen to you anymore. We spotted these deer up on this ridge. We weren't sure what was there. Made a stalk, got the wind in our favor. This deer comes out, I see his antlers, I'm ready, full draw. I figured a little over 30 yards or so. I released, arrow just, that beaming, beamingized him. And I mean, it was, it was all over after that. Well, this two by two decided to start walking up the hillside and we watched him walk up there. And as he got up, all of a sudden, there's three or four other bucks come running off this hillside towards us. And I look back up at the top of the hill and there's Ralph giving us thumbs up. Well, obviously he was successful up there. <sighs> All right, we hit him. I saw him go this way. What was that? Right here. Yeah, baby. Come on. Huh? You don't like my scream? I my scream again. You don't like my scream? Do, again. Do you have him? Sorry, I can't up. whistle. Is he there? He's right here. You see him? Oh, yeah. Oh, Lord, thank you. Oh. 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 Thank you. Way to make it happen. Oh. A four by three. Oh, he's a four by three. He's a four by, really? That's an oh inch. God. He's a five. <laughs> Look at this. Arrow five, baby. The absolute best black tail hunting you'll ever see in your life. We ain't never seen so many bucks and what great hosts. I mean, this is it. And to share it with RJ and Vicky and Kenneth and Dan and Louie and Big Jim, a teen marine, everybody. This is. In the book. Yeah, this is a blessing. You know, we've hunted with Jim and Tina Marie in Mexico a bunch. We have, we, mule deer, coos deer, I mean, lots of fun things. And now we actually get to go to their home. 
Yeah, in California. California. See the lodge and check the whole thing out. We can check out their digs, see how they do. It's your first bow hunting license. You're hunting on your first bow hunt, buddy. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. He's got a bright orange Hoyt with him, too, so he's pretty pumped. This is actually, I think this is one of the first times he's, well, it's his first out-of-state license that he's signing. So, yeah, he was just down there with Hoppy and his kid, and he, he started guiding. So he helped he helped drag all the hogs and the gators out, and, we, and he got his first tip. Yeah. When we called him up, we're like, okay, well, you know, you want to bring your boat? Well, I kind of like this guiding thing and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, good, they you can take over Arrow 5. There you go. So if you need help dragging, he's the man. He is the man. Right. He's pretty good at it. You better eat more than that, then. Oh, my goodness. I don't know if I've ever seen this many anywhere. And so organized. <laughs> Holy. organized to get them in there. And these are all from the rancher? Uh, about eight, probably 85% of them are little, maybe 90% of them are. But these are all uh, matching sets, these stacks in here. Like this is a, a 144 probably. But the bases are... This, Look this at weird. that. It'll Look at them. that. Thank you. These are the, these are the impressive ones. This is a 170. Oh my goodness. Jim's son found this here about 21 or so years ago. So it's an old, old shed. That one's from a different ranch across the river. Wow, buddy, this is, this is fabulous. Yeah, it's become an obsession now that I have quite a few. Ooh, nice deer. Yeah, that one's a hell of a management book right there. But that's one we'll we'll shoot to get RJ on. Just spotted a couple more bucks feeding up on that hillside, and what what Jim was telling us was is I mean these deer, you find them in one of these ditches, and they pretty much maintain in that area. So what we might do is get up there, try to bump them, and then turn it around, set up in a mare step ground blind, and he said that's a he said that's a massive management deer for RJ. It wasn't a big one. It was a younger one. It was right here. There's your camera. Checking this pipe. Buck. There's a buck. He's hanging. That's a good sign. We got, we got your your black tail buck hanging here. He likes this ridge. Well, we moved our blind to where the four by was hanging out. We got our spy point set up, and we'll be back to get ready for the evening hunt. August 10, 2013, it begins. RJ, you got your release? So we're on our way back to the blind and we're going up the hill and I noticed a nice buck was already bedded up on top. And just like that, he's gone. He wasn't bumped that hard, so we decided to still settle in for the evening. It didn't take long and we had some action. A few does, a small spike showed up, but no A point. And then suddenly we noticed the A point was on his way in. I could tell RJ was excited and so was I, but we had to wait for that perfect shot. Unfortunately, that buck didn't present it. He walked off, but that's the way it goes. That's why they call it hunting. Bucks are just over this hill. It's our last morning, and we decided to take a drive and locate a blacktail for RJ. And with it being spot and stock, we all decided that it'd be best if RJ used a rifle.
Yeah, buddy. Sweet. Sweetheart. <laughs> we got Daddy set up on the escape route with his bow. All those other ones are going to go that way. One, two, three, four. I don't see the fifth one. He's down. Archie got a deer. Archie got a deer. Archie just shot the first black-tailed deer with the gun. Thank you. Good job, buddy. Good job. You better thank Mr. Jim. Get up and give him a hug. Buddy, I'm telling you what, that kid's, he's a good shot. Yeah. When he's got a rest, he's a great shot. Look at that. So let's see. It's a two by one. <laughs> is that what he is? He's got one little thing here that I was trying, so. It's your first black tail. The body size a little smaller than one the white tails at home, huh? Mm -hmm. And the racks don't get huge, huge, do they? Mm -hmm. No, but he's really cool. Do you know why they call him black tail? Black tail? Oh, okay, just check. <laughs> You see, look, at he's getting rid of his summer hide, going into their fall hide. So they're getting rid of all the long orange hair. See that? That's pretty cool, isn't it? Sweetheart, I'm proud of you. You did good. Last day here at Arrow 5 Outfitters. You've been trying hard with your Hoyt. And yesterday, decided this morning we're going to go out. We're going to borrow Tina Marie's gun, didn't we? You borrowed her gun, and you got a black tail before Mommy and Daddy. Love you, one one. Good job. Way to go! You are, you're the man! <laughs> Come here. Come on out, let me see him. Where, oh, where, where gosh, did you come up? Cool, How about that one, huh? Look at that! All in velvet? So? He did good. He, they got up on the top of the knoll, right we saw this you. big rock. By the rock, and could you, you got on the left side. See him? Yeah. Yeah, check that one out, Louie. Trip's huh? made. Congratulations. Trip's nice done. I mean, I don't. Yeah. Not sure what, what it's about. That left side. That's it. He's Good just got start. some goofy little stuff going up on the left side. He just pretty cool. So you shot a like a non-typical. Captain tail. Jimmy did okay, huh? He did very well. Huh. Awesome. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's a great day. Absolutely. Well, we just loaded up RJ's buck and started to head back to the ranch when suddenly Jim noticed a very nice buck bedded under a tree with a smaller bachelor group. There's a big buck. Oh, well, we got a big one laying there, Vic. Oh, he's pretty wide. I don't see him really wide, he's really wide. He's Holy cow. at the base of that tree over there, Ralph. See him? Do you see the other one standing up behind him? No way to get to him. Different no, which way is the wind? Take my rifle and shoot you got a rifle in here? Yeah. <laughs> make the choice. Make the I, choice. I can make it a choice. It's the last time. I mean, we gotta, we're heading back to camp. We got to get Let's going. All right. You guys probably got to go out that door, though, because I don't want them to see me on this mm -hmm. side, right? Or can we go up further? No, I'd slip, slip out here. And yeah. Get right up to that tree. It should be cool. a hill. straight shot on it. All right. He handed me the rifle, and the hunt was on. not be in the sun here. We've got to stay low. Okay, he's still bedded. I still don't see the deer. Uh, you will. She's going to kill him here shortly. <laughs> uh, Is he bedded down? Okay, I got him. Yep. Well, we just loaded up RJ's buck and started to head back to the ranch. When suddenly Jim noticed a very nice buck bedded under a tree with a smaller bachelor group. He looked at me, handed me the rifle, and the hunt was on. If we stay low, we can get to that next tree and not be in the sun here. Gotta stay low. Okay, he's still bedded. Mm. 
We drove around, we wanted to see the ranch, and we just saw a beautiful blacktail bedded over across this valley here. Beautiful. I took a nice shot at him. And you made the choice. I got my first blacktail. <laughs> Congratulations. This is it. I mean, this is what it's about. Her and RJ, I mean, all three of us had shot bucks today. You know what? It is the last day, and Jim's like, Vicky, I have my rifle, so. You did away it. Away it went. She did it. I mean, come on. Let's go over there and check him out. Oh, boy, we got to drag him back up this, too, don't we? Look at him. Oh, look at this black tail beard. Oh, thank you, Lord. That is a big black tail deer. It is wide. Look at that. What a beautiful black tail deer. None of us have ever been out here to California, and all three of us got beautiful bucks. Today, August 14th, the day before my birthday. What a beautiful birthday present. Thank you, Lord. Hey, honey, come here. <sighs> Unbelievable. Thank you, Jim, Tina Marie, everyone at Arrow 5 Outfitters. What an amazing hunt. Hmm? <laughs> it really was. I mean, I, what a way opportunities to kick off the fall. and what a way to kick off fall and what a way to end the trip. <gasps> Thank you. Proud of you. Thank you. That's called season a moment. That I mean, is you know, season a moment. Actually, I'm going home with a black tail. We're gonna have a great, <gasps> great cooler full of meat. Yeah. And three velvet bucks. I've never shot a velvet buck either. So it's my first black tail and my first velvet. Yeah, even though RJ, even though technically RJ beat me on the velvet buck and the black tail and he'll love me for it, so it's okay. So nice. <laughs> Now, was that cool or what? And RJ, cool. Vicky, all of us, you know, I mean, we all got first, our first black tails. Yeah, all together yeah. as a family. So that was pretty cool, wasn't it? How'd you like that spot and stalking in the, in the, did you ever, would you ever thought of California being that beautiful up north? Oh. No, oh it was, it was gosh. beautiful. And, and Jim and Tina Marie, you guys are oh awesome. Thank gosh. you so much for having us up there, Arrow 5 Outfitters. And of course, we can't forget to say thanks to all the dogs, right? RJ loves those dogs. Yeah. This week's want lucky to take logo. Them all home. No. This week's lucky logo was a Maristep. Ultimate ground blinds and tree stands. So what you need to do is to log on to thechoicetv.com, <laughs> click on the lucky logo button, fill out some information, and someone's gonna win some great stuff from a Maristep, as well as a lot of our other manufacturers. A lot of ton of goodies. Yeah, next ton. week's show is Adrenaline Out. Adrenaline. Bear hunting, Manitoba. Rush, Shelly. We're starting I mean, the season off great, aren't we? Yeah, it's it's with a bang. With a bang? Uh -huh. It's starting off with a bang. Wow. All right, uh, speaking of bangs, RJ, put your ears back on and. Okay, let's, let's do go one ahead more. And... You were one inch high, which is what we want to be at 100. Squeeze the trigger. Put your bolt back in. All righty. Squeeze the trigger and take your time. Whoa! <laughs> Called you. <laughs> I think we might have put too much of a charge on that one, huh? <laughs> That's where you start the new tree shot. <laughs>